people. I don't know. Um, is are we waiting for it? Is I didn't was hear Julie, from Julie or no? Jerry, yeah. so I'm not sure. Julie should be here. Okay. okay. I, or maybe just late. Yeah. All right. We're good. Yeah. Um, all right. Well, then I will call. Is this on the meeting to order? Um, what is it? September fifth, that. 9.01 a.m. It's myself, Hannah Smith, and Julie Cooper, Juan Luna, Connie Redman, and Lonzo Tackett. And then nobody. Okay, cool. Um, and public comment first. Right? Before the minutes. No public nobody on. Cool. Um, was everybody able to review the minutes from last meeting? Check yes. it over. Yes. All right. Um, can I make a motion to adopt the minutes from last meeting? I second. All right. All in favor? Yeah. Aye. Aye. All right. Um, okay. Oktoberfest updates and needs. Connie, you want to start? Okay. Here we go. I can um, follow up. It is going surprisingly well, I think. I don't yeah. know otherwise. So, you know. Um, I want to go over the budget real quick. We have a budget of $7,500. So far, we've spent or have obligated $5,147. Uh, we have um, about $2,200 for the band. Uh, we spent $1,325 $1, for banners and lamppost. That's going to be a one-time bill because we'll be able to use those year after year. Um, we have a uh, hundred dollars for the pinatas and you should be able to pick that check up on Thursday. Mm -hmm. uh, the toilets, $758. It's ridiculous what you have to pay for porta potties, but um, that's the way it is. Uh, we ordered wristbands, um, tables and chairs, $737. And I think I have 49 tables, 150 chairs. I know Jordan Winthrop talked about Estacada area community events having tables and chairs. Yeah, that's what I was just going to. And they're in the cargo mm -hmm. container over at the fire department. I talked with um, Jen at the fire department. Um, they haven't done an inventory of what's in there. And she said there's a lot of stuff in there. And she's not sure how accessible the tables and chairs are. Okay. So for this year, you know, I don't have time to go over there and, and dig through stuff and sort mm -hmm. it out. So for this year, uh, we're renting uh, tables and chairs from All American Rental, local. They'll deliver. They'll pick up. Mm -hmm. uh, and maybe next year, I don't know if, if the fire department is going to do an inventory of that cargo container or, or what. But um, maybe next year we can just get those from East. Yeah. I mean, um, they're there. So I think that's something that. Yeah. We need to capitalize on for free. Oh yeah, definitely for sure. Maybe he offered yeah. so. Mm -hmm. um, then some miscellaneous um, costs like tablecloths and that kind of stuff. Um, advertising. Um, I talked to Emke at Estacada News, and for six hundred and thirty dollars, which I uh, agreed to, we will be in the fall fun guide which comes out September 30th, and it goes to every newspaper in the Portland metro area, along with Estacada News and when and all that. Does it come out? September 30th, oh, 20th, okay. 20th, September right. 20th. Cool. So it's a week of October yeah. Fest. We have a half page ad. Hannah, thank you for this. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You know, yeah, uh, nice. so color ad, mm -hmm. um, and it's going to be, um, and hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of newspapers and people will be seeing it. So that's pretty much what we've, I say we, but me, what I've been spending so far. Um, right now we have um, 29 vendors um, for a total so far of $440 Holy moly. in Say revenue. And, and um, I'm sorry, 29 vendors? 29. Yeah, that's awesome. That's Some lot. are, uh, most are 10 by 15. A um, couple are 10 by 20. Uh, I have a friend who has a way of plotting things out. And we got plenty of room. Uh, we'll have the, the food courts, food carts down in front of Key Bank, and we still have plenty of room. So I don't know 
you had talked about Juan having a couple down there, you know, haven't seen. Yeah, I just submit the applications right now too. Okay. It's five. Okay. Five applications. So three cars and two um, 10 by 10, something like that. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Get those to me. So I can... Oh, I already put in the office. So oh. they can give it to you today. Yeah. 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 Have they... Are they paid? I mean, um, I'm gonna pay, but we okay. want to discuss. Well, the, the, the city will put them in my inbox. So just deal yeah. with the ladies. Um, the food truck says twenty bucks, or everybody is twenty bucks in twenty you know, bucks, everybody. except for the alcohol vendors, they're fifty. But everybody is is Perfect. twenty bucks. Mm -hmm. Yep. Thank you. Um, and then you know, depending on the revenue from the uh, entrance into the uh, beer garden, mm -hmm. you know, even if we we have a hundred people that's a thousand bucks so you know i think we'll be okay we're definitely going to be under our budget mm -hmm. and at some point maybe in a couple of years we'll start making money on this you know the bands the toilets um mm -hmm. those are the big things yeah um for volunteers um i still have the basketball coach is not calling me back so oh well he confirmed to me okay don't worry about i mean um you call him yeah. So he yeah. might call you back when he can't, but he confirmed to me he's going to be there okay. all day. Uh, so we have Job Corps that's going to help us set up. Um, and that's going to be pretty heavy duty stuff because we got to get the uh, construction. We got to outline the beer garden with the construction fencing um, and set up the tables. Uh, we'll have a bunch of tables inside the beer garden. Um, I'm meeting with Sarah Poet from the fire department as to we can't we can't block Broadway right down the middle, but I think we can as long as it's with stuff that we can move real quickly if the fire engine needs to go through. Mm -hmm. So I, th I think we're going to have plenty of room for uh, um, people to sit down and eat. Uh, mm -hmm. Some of the tables we'll be using in the kids areas because mm -hmm. um, we're going to have the booths facing. So the, the the vendors will be facing the sidewalk. Uh, yeah, sa sidewalk in the businesses. Yeah. So the yeah. center will kind of be the the back end. Yeah. Of the, yeah. Yeah. And um, yeah. there was a question about why we did that, but in in past yeah. events, when we've had the vendors facing the street, even though we have businesses on Broadway, people aren't walking by them. Right. You know. So no, that's why we want idea. the vendors to face the store, so mm -hmm. they'll be going by Both. the mm -hmm. businesses. Yeah. Um, Lonzo's taking care of all the volunteers for the beer gardens for wristbands, ID check, whatnot. Um, and those yeah. can be combined. I mean, you can have two people That's check an exactly. ID, wristbands, and get the money, you know. Mm -hmm. Um, and I did talk with Julie about periodically we'll be collecting the money, and she thought you had someplace safe in. Yes, I, I have a safe in. Okay, because I don't want a lot of money hanging around. Um, I still, um, still need some i'm going to i'm going to talk to adult teen challenge about helping with takedown mm. and the only thing we have to do right immediately after the event is uh, take up the barricades and make sure the streets are open uh we can wait till sunday or monday uh, and put the tables down so the all-american rental can come and pick them up mm -hmm. tables and chairs all stacked in one place so um uh, I'll talk to Adult Teen Challenge for helping with that. Um, I've got a couple volunteers lined up for pie eating. Uh, I've got a couple of kids lined up for kids activities. We need some people. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you've talked to some folks. Um, yeah. We want to try and get names and sizes for t-shirts right away because, Julie, we want to have mm. t-shirts for volunteers. Oh, cool. Okay. I didn't okay. know that. That's awesome. Yeah. So let, you and I need to sit down and figure out how many people we need for each kids yeah. activity yeah okay. i don't think it'll be a lot a lot of times uh parents hang around with their kids and they can help mm -hmm. too okay yeah we'll talk first so i i think we need um i know jerry brought up misters i don't, I don't know. think it's gonna you know hot. um i know the uh high school dance team is going to have a dunk tank oh, that's and right. they'll be on the on um, on third on the side street right by yeah. uh reliance and that's where they're the porta potty is going to be sorry about that, but you know, um, so I, I, I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. Don't There's know what the no, weather's going to be. I had it in my notes, but I was, and I don't know where I to get one right be, now. I'm sure yeah. I can find out, but um, I think it'll be fine. yeah. 
and also uh, another thing, uh, Parks and Rec has like 13 pop-ups. So once we get an idea of what the weather is going to mm -hmm. be like, if we mm -hmm. want to put up some pop-ups around so mm -hmm. and put tables and Just chairs under that, yeah, we can do that. So what's left over in the budget? I know you said it earlier. Uh, right now, I have obligated $5,147 in our budget, $7,500. Yeah. So we still have, what, $2,000? Okay, so, cool. Because we still be... have to do some... Yeah, some you've activity got to do some stuff. purchasing. Can, and that's not stuff. counting, you know, the, the money we got from the vendors and what we're sure. going to get from the, the beer garden. Mm -hmm. So you need to do some purchasing for kids stuff. Mm -hmm. We'll need to cover the cost of t-shirts. Okay. You know, but I, I, I think we're doing real well. Awesome. So but, um, any questions? Yeah, I'm trying to think. Um, thank you to Evelyn and the ladies in the front office for taking all the vendor applications. Thank mm -hmm. you to Lonzo for dealing with OLCC. Mm -hmm. That's huge. Mm -hmm. You don't know how huge it was. That super is. easy. It was, yeah, it was I, very, I, very easy. And I had the, um, gosh, one of the uh, OLCC auditors just lives right up on the hill. And so I met her. Oh, good. And yeah, she helped good. me through the process. And well, maybe if that's yeah. your only focus, it's easy. I oh, mean, yeah. Right. Know, yeah. The, <laughs> as long the as other person, here, then when Nancy was doing it, it was there were just so many moving parts. Mm -hmm. So thank you for doing that. Hannah, yeah. thank you for this wonderful design of the yeah. flyer. Yeah. So, so fun. Cool. Um, and I guess I can. Oh wait. Um I saw somewhere online, I think you responded, the beer garden. Is that staying open? Yeah, like extra? I'm, I'm I saw it open till so, till 10 o'clock. Oh okay. Th okay. Yeah, when we close. Well, I think but on our on our the restaurant till when the restaurant closes. Yeah, I'm I'm do I'm doing that with, oh, the, with the other uh okay. with the other beer beer vendors. Okay. Um and that's oh, what I cool. submitted to the um yeah, so we'll still be taking more tickets and sure. But our special event permit with the city says nine p.m. for the beer garden. Okay. So can you close well, yeah, down close just the, the outside yeah. part? Yeah. yeah. Okay. I, I can do that, and then I'll just have the after party at the okay at the brewery. Okay. So you know that's <laughs> yeah. something we need to make note of for next year. Okay. So, okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It shouldn't be a Easy. problem. Awesome. Well, thanks, Connie. Can't control the weather. That's the only thing. So yeah. <laughs> be thinking positive thoughts mm -hmm. for dry. Yeah. I don't care about temperature, but mm -hmm. dry. Yeah. Um, great. And anybody? Comments? Mm -hmm. Nope. Mm -hmm. You'll be open? Yes. Right? Yep. Awesome. Yep. Hope so. Cool. Yeah. Um, all right. Well, next is Main Street Manager. Assign the Main Street Manager. Um. How do we want to go about this? Anybody want to just off right off well, the bat? I guess um, I'd like to see what that involves. What, yeah. yeah. You know, what, what does that involve? Uh, yeah. Yes. You know, I've been what around the... it for 10 some years. So, but I'd like to know what being the main street manager means. Yeah. Does that mean doing all the reports and all that kind of stuff? Mm, I don't think that's our job. What? Right, are, Evelyn? Are you able to? input anything on that because i'm not sure of what the oh, well, role is is the main street manager is that what we were talking about last week where um last month was it the chamber and the dec paid for a person that worked half and half on well what, what we, was we, that different different that was different yeah. that was a secretary right yeah. well it's Years ago, when we first started, we um, we had a wasn't called a Main Street manager because we weren't Main Street then. Mm -hmm. um, but we had somebody that was keeping, and it was strictly part time, not very many hours. Mm -hmm. And then when we went to being a Main Street organization, Nancy Hoffman, we had some couple people before her, but Nancy took it on. Uh, she was paid. I don't remember how many hours, but she took care of everything, uh, dealing with the Justice Department for the nonprofit, dealing with, excuse me, all the reports, everything. Um, so I, I don't really know what Main Street Manager involves. Mm -hmm. Like um, going to the um, 
the yearly conference yeah. and other yearly things. Conferences. Mm -hmm. I think in, for it had nothing to do with the, I think the lady or the job that you're talking about, mm -hmm. I think that's assigned through um, the city that somebody that we, yeah. we get, that we have mm -hmm. uh, because we're in the main street program, yeah. Yeah. that's uh, staff. Mm -hmm. Um and I know we have Alan and Elena here that they can follow, or mm -hmm. sorry, Taylor. Um, but I think we were looking for just our DEC, a Main Street manager to kind of like, contact just be a, yeah. Like a yeah. with everybody else. Um, and we didn't really have any, a list of to-dos. Yeah. It was just kind of so somebody to wrap our heads around yeah. this whole next year of whether we're going to be involved or not. Mm -hmm. And Taylor. Do you have any info? Yeah, I'm just gonna come in. Um, you got sounds like you guys kind of understand. We staff will still be, um, you know, because of our unique situation where you guys are not a separate entity, you know, independent nonprofit. Mm -hmm. um, city staff handles all of the administrative side of things, so we, you know, handle the quarterly reports. Yeah. We, um, not that there's a ton of all of that to do, but we have been, as we talked about last time, we have been also the main contact in their system. And so we've been getting invites to these, you know, um, annual mm. Main Street Network meeting where yeah. the someone who's like more of, you know, one of the members of your group would be attending those. And we were talking about how it kind of doesn't make sense for staff to attend those because you guys are really the more appropriate representative for, you know, your group. Um, and so I think that might be where this is coming from. Who wants to be, you could probably assign, you know, if you wanted to have like co-managers, um, but who's gonna kind of take a little more ownership over, um, following all of the those different kind of like networking and other types of opportunities that you know a representative of the group might um be best to participate mm -hmm. in if that makes sense yeah absolutely thank you i can um, just add on talking really quick oh, hey. i can also follow yes. up and um i'm sure that there's information on the main street website as to what the main street manager duties are and I can follow up with everyone and kind of get more information on exactly what those what that looks like mm -hmm. awesome okay yeah that'd be awesome thank you Alan um so with that being said do we want to wait until he sends some I'd like information to look at or the, people yeah. do a little bit more research yeah. mm -hmm. like uh, before we make a decision yeah um because I don't think we're making from last meeting we're not making any decisions mm -hmm. to stay with the main street or not for a while um we're kind of pushing that off yeah from what i remember Probably we're not going to make any decisions soon yeah, yeah. so yeah. we have time to yeah um we all need to do more research yeah, <laughs> yeah. and just in, in general the main street program yeah um would so that be really helpful alan and taylor yeah i was going to ask would can you guys hear me okay yep yeah um would any of you be interested in i know we've got oktoberfest coming up there's a lot going on but mm -hmm. if alan shared um contact information or you know url links to the places where he would do this research would any of you be willing or interested to jump in and kind of do that fact finding yourself <laughs> I could probably take a gander at it. Yeah. Yep. Was that Lonzo? Yeah. We got confirm from All Lonzo right. and Connie. And then we Great. are absolutely here to support. I know that things are about to get busy with Oktoberfest. Yeah. If it doesn't happen or you need help for any reason, we're totally here. Um, but just kind of, yeah, I want, I want the ball to be as much in your court as you want it to be. Mm -hmm. Good. Good. Okay. Yeah, I think there's a, a few things with um with that and then down is um where is it? Oh, budget and stuff. I think we're right now we're just trying to get through Oktoberfest <laughs> and then push some things off till after 
so we can see what we made and stuff. Um, but okay, so we're going to not assign a main street manager this time. We're going to do some research, um, see what the job, not job, but the duties entail mm -hmm. and kind of go from there and then yeah. maybe wait for Julie to be here too. Yes. Um, and see who else we have join our committee. Um, all right. Anything else on that? No. Mm -mm. Um, okay. So the main street conference that's coming up in October, is that the fourth, fifth, sixth, mm -hmm. something like that, that you attached. Okay. Um, were you guys able to read that over mm -hmm. kind of, there's a sheet, mm -hmm. um, um, just kind of a side note to that. I had submitted uh, three nominations mm. for awards. And that's where you get them, correct? Yeah. At this, uh, yeah. One was for Tommy, the volunteer, who's just a wonderful, I say kid, but he's not a kid, but he's just fabulous. Um, I submitted Lonzo's uh, Time Travelers and also our Door Hangers. Uh, Tommy was selected to be the volunteer award. Oh, cool. Oh, that's so, awesome. yeah, it yeah. is. Mm -hmm. And so I'll be going down with him and his mother and grandmother for the award ceremony uh, the night of the 4th. Oh, cool. Um, they suggested that we put in a time traveler for next year. Oh, really? Yeah, huh? yeah. That's so, awesome. um, and then they, nothing about the door hangers. That was just a last minute, you know, mm -hmm. promotion Volunteers. type of thing. This is what we've done. But, yeah. but Tommy got it. And cool. I don't know if any of you have worked with him. I think he's helped over there in the uh yeah tommy wood he's just fabulous mm -hmm. i mean energy willing to do anything and help anytime so i'll what, be going down how for old the is he or what is he young or old or? he's 27 oh, okay. 26 27 oh cool yeah awesome I don't, i've never yeah. probably recognized him but the name yeah awesome probably in his 20s you know i think he's just great yep cool yeah so awesome. that I'll be going down so for the you... awards, but I don't plan on attending the conference. I'll be out of town. Mm -hmm. uh, fifth, sixth, Same. seventh, eighth, ninth. What, where is it? It's in yeah. Independence, which is out. Changes each year. I can see if I can get away and go to that. It looks like I can learn a whole bunch of stuff. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's obviously not um were acquired right right i mean we don't get a penalty there's no, no. it's just and hope and hope somebody can go register for just certain parts of it as well you don't have to go for the entire thing okay because it sounds like wednesday we'll have connie for wednesday sure evening yeah the award yep um and I've, I've, I've been to them before and one of the best mm -hmm. parts of the conferences is the networking you do yeah. especially with other people from small towns like Estacada. Mm -hmm. And it's really encouraging to see what um, what some small towns have done and mm -hmm. what we Good have ideas. the potential to do. Yeah. Um, and that's an independence. Um, oh, okay, right here. So, Lonzo, you said you'll take a look at it. Yeah. Okay. But, yeah. but no, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> It's hard. It's that's a. It's hard. I I know I'll be out of town. Um, yeah, I'm gonna um, take a, a picture of this. Uh, send it for to, the latter part of it, but to Becca and see if we have anything going on, and maybe we can make a family. Make, yeah, make a family thing with it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and the 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 city pays for the um mm -hmm. registration room and mileage. room yeah. or lodge and okay. travel. Yeah, um, I'll uh, yeah. Let me take a picture. Yeah, they set you up. Um, and if you do want to attend Lonzo, let me know because I have the registration. Okay. Like, so I'll have to register you. Killer. Yeah. Okay, cool. And then well, Connie, you'll you'll have to register because you'll She's be already there. already got me registered. Oh, cool. yeah. yeah, awesome. Uh, Along with Tommy and his mother and grandmother. Oh, fun. So fun. Cool. Take pics. Okay. Um, awesome. So next we have interview we're gonna interview some applicants yes. just one uh, yeah, sherry looks like shane couldn't make it uh, okay so i think we have sherry here awesome yeah. cool yay hi hi sherry so vibrant love that outfit 
Um, okay, so Jer Sherry, do you want to come up to, is the mic on over there? Testy? Test not, yep. <laughs> awesome. Vertically challenged right here. Yeah. Hello, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Um, well, thanks for being here. Absolutely. And your awesome application. You've got a a big background. I do have a of, big background. Of stuff. Um, so what what do you want to do first? Do you want to have her introduce herself? Do you want to just start off with the questions? You know, you you have your well, you say new you. resident to Estacada. How new? <laughs> Um, so we just moved here. Well, we just took possession of our home in Cascadia Ridge. The end of April, we did a whole bunch of remodeling to it for the whole entire month of May and didn't move in until mid-June. Oh, and we're still remodeling. So well, welcome. welcome to Estacada. Thank you. Great. Yeah, we I attended, um, hadn't even moved in, quite moved into the house yet, but attended the chamber of commerce event. Oh. Okay. Um, brought, we bought a table, my husband and I bought a table and then we brought some people from Gresham and then some local people okay. that we had met. Mm -hmm. Cool. Good. And you're local. Local. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. Yeah. So one of the things that we always ask people is, um, you know, there's a commitment, uh, coming to meetings, uh, getting involved in events. Uh, the main events that we do, I don't know if I'm stealing your thunder or no. Okay. Um, no the 4th of July parade, um, now Oktoberfest, we get involved with the tree lighting. Um, and it's not a huge amount of time, but for the day of the event, it can be. So we want to make sure people understand that there's a commitment to get involved in that kind of stuff. Yeah. I think with my resume, I think that I've shown that well over, yeah. you know, 35 plus years that I, I'm willing and able to make that commitment. I wouldn't be here if I couldn't make that commitment to you. That's not fair to you guys. Mm -hmm. What has been your favorite um, doing in the past? You've got, oh, you've got boy. a lot of fun stuff. I've but, done a lot of different um, stuff. I think, I think probably um, starting my own um, football fan club. I think that that, yeah. that just, allowed so much networking yeah. you know not on, hold on. i was gonna say what well next? i am a, i'm a i'm a season ticket holder for the dallas cowboys oh. <laughs> oh. i know i heard the whole the whole seattle thing i was like uh-oh yeah. that's when i are gonna go to blows yeah. <laughs> no um i think that was the i i mean that was really um that was just fun. And, and even to this day, even though I don't have the club anymore, um, I'm still in touch with people that came and it was really great to see like little ones mm -hmm. where, you know, they came and they were in the, the booth at Buffalo Wild Wing and they were sitting in their little, and now they're in high school or they're, you know, going off to college. And so that's been really, really great. Um, mm -hmm. I think though, one of the one things that I'm most proud of is being able to say that um, I did in, I was involved in Fairview <clears throat> for an event um, and Fairview had a long history of creating events and never had an event that actually made money. Mm -hmm. And, um, me and an officer that of the local PD there, um, we were the first <clears throat> to be recognized um, for actually having an event that made money, that made the, the community nice. money, and they were in the black. And we, we raised so much money that we were able to have a fund for that event. And that actually happened to be National Night Out. We were recognized as, as one of the brand new rookies and um, that event to this day is just extremely well done. Mm. So, um, you know, it was a lot of hard work, but yeah. that's what it takes to have an event, yeah. be able to be in the black, <laughs> so yeah. to speak. Yeah. 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 Awesome. Well, I personally appreciate you applying because um, we've got some old timers around. And we need some new blood coming in. So, you know, most of the board now is fairly new. So to have that energy and that experience and in, in that background is refreshing. Thank you. Happy to be here. Mm -hmm. Happy to get involved. Yeah. Be um, careful what you say. <laughs> <laughs> and when do we meet? Today's Tuesday. Mondays at nine. Not a problem. Zoom or in person. 
Yeah, I work from home. I work for the state. So mm -hmm. I work from home. I probably most likely would would probably um, attend via Zoom. It would just be easier. Yeah. Um, I've got a great little office set up. One side's personal, the other side's office. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so I probably would just do the Zoom if that's not a problem. Mm -hmm. yeah. And, you know, if there's any days where I'm, I'm going to be off on that day, anyhow, then I would be showing up mm -hmm. in person. Okay. Yeah. Cause that's one of our biggest thing is, is meetings, uh, people making meetings. Absolutely. Not a problem that's at all. Right. Um, well, and one of the things that I've been meaning to bring up for a long time is um, we need to have people that shadow people. Um, I know in 2025, I will not be here for Oktoberfest. I've got a national reunion to go to. So need to have somebody that's shadowing me for mm -hmm. 4th of July and for Oktoberfest. Yeah. It's not You're just assigning ahead. committees, but somebody like who's that. walking alongside me to mm -hmm. see how that's done. Yeah. So just want to put that out there. Yeah. It's good to know because we still have next year, but yeah, 2025. Um, all right. Well, any other questions for Sherry? No, thank you. No. Yeah. Thanks for being here. Thank you. We have your number, right? <laughs> um, and so how do we go about, did Shane call in or show up? He's he's not online and he's not here um so okay do we what do we do we make a decision now um evelyn i know in the past we've had we have mm -hmm. um i don't know if maybe alan or taylor if we have to do it right now we make a re uh, recommendation recommendation to, to city, city council, council. Mm -hmm. okay um versus waiting for a next meeting correct we have to, to uh, yeah. for, have help to. me taylor <laughs> okay you don't have to make a decision right now your recommendation could be um requesting that the city council waits until you have a formal recommendation to give them um it is possible that for whatever reason they might the city council might want to go ahead and make their decision without your recommendation. Mm. Um, I think that's kind of unlikely. They sure. they just decide. The same thing happened with the um, traffic and public safety committee where they wanted to wait until their next meeting to make a decision on their appointment. And so um, the city council decided to wait until they had their formal recommendation too. So I think that's the most likely outcome if you want to go for that. But I just do need to risk caveat there's a chance that they might move forward if for whatever reason they want to rush to get someone appointed here mm -hmm. i don't think that's likely but yeah okay know. thank you um so absolutely yeah. yeah um thoughts yeah mm -hmm. got a nod mm -hmm. so can we make a motion mm -hmm. to recommend to city council to appoint Sherry Fox Hames as a Can we do that? DC member. Mm -hmm. I'll second. All right. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Yeah. Aye. All right. Done. Thank you. Um, all right. Thanks, Sherry. Appreciate you. Thank you. You can stay, you can leave. You can definitely what leave Calvary fans. Have to <laughs> yeah, no. for sure. <laughs> but are you are you a duck or no? Um, I'm a or fan. beaver. Um, well, for college, you for care college, about college. I'm a Husky fan, because I'm oh, geez, okay. from from Washington State. Yeah, yeah, right. left side of the mountain. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Steelers in Kansas City. Jeez, <laughs> sorry, Sherry. Uh, oh, uh, just gets worse. <laughs> <laughs> Julie's like, I don't know. It'll bring some great diversity to the group. Oh, there we go. <laughs> diversity, <laughs> yeah, diversity. <laughs> Love it. Check. Um. Yeah, we don't have much left. We have, so that's done. Content for September. That's me, newspaper, social media, e-newsletter. E um, we have lots going out regarding posts, and I've sent Evelyn lots of scheduled posts for yeah. mainly Oktoberfest countdowns. Yeah. Um, yeah. You know, reminders to bring your bike decorated. And yeah, we pumpkin need to painting start and, that up. Yeah. Um, so there's a few posts about that. Uh, newsletter, e-newsletter going out. Uh, one last one about volunteers and Oktoberfest. Um, so that's kind of the main focus about September. 
I think that was it. And then, um, so that's all, that's all great. Um, and I think number nine, our budget, can we just, we'll talk about this after Oktoberfest, if there's updates, mm -hmm. I think it'll be better to maybe review our bu right. budget after. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, see what we made, see what's going on. And then we can really look at that. Cause I think it's not a mess, but just yeah. get back on track <laughs> with that. If that's okay with everybody. Yes. Um, and then I think that's it. Public comment. Anybody? No. Nope. No. All right. Um, anybody? Commissioner comments? Yeah. Uh -huh. You good? Uh, I don't know. I don't know if this is on or not, but mm -hmm. um have we heard anything about the vacant building? What's going in down there? The old Art Smith building? About oh. which building? The Art Smith? Mm -hmm. The old Art Smith or right there on Broadway. What's going on with that? Um well, I've heard. Yes. But so, confirm. Can't can't tell you. I've I've heard um <laughs> somebody bought it. It's almost well, it's it's been same owner for a number of years. Did somebody buy it from them and mm -hmm. they're willing to mm -hmm. it's apparently um going through and this is all hearsay. Yeah. So I'm not for Here's the record, off the record, I don't know. <laughs> um <laughs> And I think it's last time I heard it was a, um, gosh, what is this called? Discounts plus. Yes. Yes. Yeah. It's what? A discounts, discounts plus. plus store. So another store. Oh, okay. Um, they have one in Gresham, I think, Oregon city. What kind of store? It's basically like a, not a dollar. Costco. General no. Okay. It's bulk of all that stuff sold cheaper. It's food, it's lamps, but it's filling up art. the space. Yeah. Um that's awesome. Kind of everything and anything. Shoes, mm -hmm. clothes. Taylor, is that anything food. that you can but like I said, that's is she still there? So yeah, I'm not sure, but we could um look into what's going on there and bring some information back to y'all next month. Right. Yeah, we're just speculating. Do you have any info, Julie? Oh Are you um, just asking? No, I just, just heard that they were in the works yeah. of um based on the realtor who's mm -hmm. um selling the building. Yeah. That's exciting. Yeah. New stuff. Oh, what about your building? Is somebody renting the space out or yeah, so we got um the large grant for the city, which is awesome. Mm -hmm. Um, so we, right now we're demoing and then going to continue with construction. And then we're going to split it into two storefronts mm -hmm. back to how it was first built. Um, and then the left side for now is supposed to be chamber and forest, mm -hmm. oh, uh, like a visitor center for us Yeah. Um, and then the right side will be a much bigger flag lot um retail space That's for awesome. a lot of interest but no contracts or anything okay um so fair. we'll see one step closer yeah yeah that's so hopefully awesome. summer um one. so yeah things are looking up i saw some stuff on facebook oh i have a big um job offer so i cannot let it pass this mm -hmm. but we the last day we're gonna be served food so far it's the 23rd mm -hmm. after the event we're gonna be closed maybe for like a less than a month a month so mm -hmm. and then we're gonna be reduced the menu and my partner can take it over the truck so this is we still in conversation to see what we're gonna do with a food truck and keep it here because mm -hmm. we have a lot of customers they don't but like the idea to see mm -hmm. leave us yeah but are we losing you on the commission? Uh, not yet. Okay. No. Good. Good. No, I good. really talk about this okay. because I part of this. Mm -hmm. So. Good. Well, congrats on the new job. Thank you. Where's your new job at? Oh, it's just you. Oh, the parking's terrible. <laughs> well. Nice. Not really. Well, that is terrible. <laughs> but it's a big chunk. Good. Work. Mm -hmm. Good. 
I used to be aware there before, but this is the fourth time they contact me and then I reject and reject and reject. Mm. But now uh, we have, and then what I, I want to be. That's and great. See how it works. Yes. Good. Awesome. Good. Yeah. Thank you. Yep. All right. But we're going to be high calendars. Maybe we're going to be redo everything again. Yeah. Make it simple. Make them a little bit more simple yeah. and keep at least like three to four days open mm -hmm. to continue being here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. okay. Awesome. Well, we're excited to see um, what happens. But a couple of weeks till Oktoberfest. It's good, good weather and get it done with. Yeah. Um, yeah. All right. If nobody else has any more comments, I can um, time it. Meeting. 9.42 a.m. and meeting adjourned. Good. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks, so Will you...